Morning, Ili. Morning. Morning. How are you, Lena? Fine. Uh, very sleepy. <laughs> very sleepy because of the day. <laughs> It's rainy, right? It's raining. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here oh. it is. It's I thought it was going to be different, you know, really, uh, because uh, on Monday or Tuesday, I don't remember the, the day, uh, I felt like nice weather, uh, windy. It was windy like, mm -hmm. like some years ago. And yes. I thought, wow, we changed now, but now it's raining. <laughs> so yes. it's just, uh, the Monday, the Monday bar was uh, October. Yeah, it was beautiful. I, I just remember my childhood. <laughs> when when I was a child, eh, how old are you, really? I'm sorry. Uh, 33. 33. Okay, so eh, I don't know if you remember when, when we, were, we were kids. Well, eh, it was in the 90s, I think, 90s, more or less. Uh, and by this time in October, we had already finished the, the school. The class. Mm -hmm. yeah. All the classes were already finished. Sometimes if you had problems with some subjects or, or some exams, you had to go and do the exams and that's it. But uh, nowadays people finish classes in November, yeah, yeah and I remember. this year, this year, uh, uh, knows uh, how in um, what months ends the class. Exactly, so. there are a lot of uh, a lot of people that are going to finish. Uh, you know, in, for example, in some some cousins that I have and nephews, they finish the second uh, the second week of November, the first week of November. When I was a child, no, it was October and in everybody, October. we have vacation yes. in October, November, December, and January. And we yes. started classes in February. In February. <laughs> and it was very nice. Everybody wearing sweaters, right? Yes, I I remember I was uh, uh, swimming, mm -hmm. swimming class. Wow, a swimming class, very nice. Yes, it, it, on vacation and mm -hmm. oh, so it, it was hot. It was very cold. Cold, yes, <laughs> <laughs> yes. I uh, in Club de Leones. Mm -hmm. Yes, in Club de Leones. Okay, ah, beautiful, nice. So you learn to swim okay. on vacations. Yes. Oh, that's cool. Very yeah. good. I couldn't learn. I always, I had an accident when I was uh, 12 years old. I had an accident in a, in a, in a swimming pool. I was, I, I didn't know how to swim, but a friend of mine pushed me into a swimming pool and I had an accident. And so from that situation, now I am afraid of, you know, I go to swimming pools, but I only sit down. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I don't feel comfortable. Only, I don't feel only only the the the, the feet. And, yeah, uh, yeah. You know, only the feet, and or sometimes I go into the swimming pool, but just standing and taking okay, holding the 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 the, 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 the edges of the swimming pool. But anyways, it's because I had this one when I was a child. Hey, Gabby is here. Just saying a good morning, Franklin. See, morning. Elena. Hello. Hi, Gabby. Morning, welcome. Teacher. Welcome. Okay. Hello. Good morning. How are you? Very relaxed. Sleepy. <laughs> drinking coffee. You know, the morning is very uh, wind, uh, windy, uh, rainy. I'm coming to the gym. No. Yes. Really? Yes. Coming yes. from the gym? <gasps> Yes. Oh, <laughs> so the gym is next to your house? <laughs> yes. Uh, what time do you go to the gym at five o'clock? Um, 40, 40 at, at three. Four media, perdón. Four thirty? Four thirty. Oh my God, Jesse. You are my heroine. <laughs> wow, 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 wow. 
you know, uh, yes, it's, it's a matter of being, you know, something that comes inside, right? Your personal decision. Yes. Here, here uh -huh, uh, where I live here is a closed area. So I have all the possibilities to run, to do exercise. There is a gym here. So the gym is inside the, the residential and I have the opportunity to go, but I never go. So it's a matter of... <laughs> 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 so I have all the opportunities, but I prefer to eat. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Jesse! wow, congratulations. I'm so proud of you, you, huh? Very nice. I'm gonna give you a... <laughs> very nice Jesse. very nice 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 okay my friends we are going to start a class for today um now we start section number two okay this is this by the the what yesterday we had a week okay and section number two remember the topics for two, for section number two i uh, um are quite easy uh, we're gonna practice okay um the the topic that i'm going to present today so what is the topic that we're going to study today guys okay this is infinitives we're gonna learn how to um describe purposes okay how to describe purposes how to in this case, use, okay, infinitives and gerunds, right? In this case, guys, let me ask, okay, you, that's it. For example, I'm, I'm going to ask uh, Gabby, okay, Gavita, okay, morning, Gavita. Um, Gabby, for you, this is your personal opinion, okay? Uh, what do you think is the most amazing invention around the world for whatever gadget, you know, you know, technological, whatever, any kind of, what do you think is the best, okay, the best uh, invention ever? I don't know, maybe I start with the, with the light, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Okay, life? No, uh, La luz. Light. Ah, the, 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 the lights. Ah, okay, uh, okay, okay. Important. Uh huh. Very good. Well, because uh, is it, the the start with the old technology. I don't know. With the old technology. Ah, so you mean the electricity? Uh, I exactly. Ah, yes. okay, okay. Yes. Ah, okay. The electricity. Okay. Very good. Very nice. If if we don't have electricity, we don't have anything, Gabby. Exactly. <laughs> okay, that's it. Very good. Uh, let me ask Frank. Okay, hi Frank. Good morning. Hello, hello Frank. Hi, morning. Hello, hello morning. For you, Frank. Hello. Uh, hello. What do you think is the best invention for you? Gabby said electricity, and for you, what's the best invention? Um. Eh, uh, uh, para rayo, ajá, para rayo, eh, quien creó el para rayo, hoy Benjamin Franklin, Benjamin Franklin, work. so that was similar to the electricity, ah, ah, okay, eh, 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 it attracted the, the oh. yeah, devices, I don't know, something that you consider, wow, mm -hmm. Uh, teléfono. The telephone. Uh -huh. Okay, yes. the telephone. No the cell phone, the telephone. No, the telephone. The yes. Telephone. Okay, for communications. Okay, very good, very good. For you, Ili, what do you think is the best invention that you could have? Maybe the, the airplane. The airplanes, okay. The airplanes for transporting, okay, from one country to another one, okay, very good. What about you, Karen? Morning, good morning. Good morning. Okay, I the best invasion uh -huh, for you. This is your personal opinion. Yes, the, the airplane. The airplane too? Okay, okay, yes. very good. This is, okay, you know, this is something that comes to my mind like, the how can an airplane fly <laughs> it's too heavy okay but you know mm -hmm, inventors okay got this Vero, what about for you the best invention ever yeah for me you know, 
the uh, energy, maybe. The energy, okay, the energy, okay, okay, very good. Araceli, what about for you? Money. The money. <laughs> <laughs> The money or good morning? I'm sorry, I didn't listen. No, I say morning. Ah. <laughs> um, I said the money. And the... But, the, but money is okay. <laughs> money is okay. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, I, I am a little deaf today. Uh -huh, I listen, money. Wow, well, but it's a good invention too. Huh? <laughs> okay, in the past, people used cacao. You know, cacao as a currency. Okay. So if you had to choose yes. one, okay, from the devices, uh, Araceli, that you use in your house, what do you think it could be the best invention? Um, the acetaminophen. <laughs> oh, the acetaminophen, the aspirin. Okay. Oh, yes. okay. It could be medicine in general. Okay. Exa, what about for you? The computer. Well, it, <laughs> no. No. Okay. In my in my house, the kitchen. Ah, oh, the stove. The the stove. The, the uh -huh. Only the yes. device, the stove. Mm. Yes, and in the world, I think the the well. Ah, okay, okay. Uh huh. The the stove, okay. For me, for me, you know, in my house is the refrigerator. <laughs> I don't know why. Okay, I, I when I see that, oh, you know, they make our work easier. Okay, that's it. I remember uh, I was oh, a long time ago. My grandfather already died, but when I was a teenager, I remember I asked my father, my grandfather, eh, "Hey, grandpa." How did you do, okay, in the past for keeping the, 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 the food, you know, for example, milk or extra beans or I don't know, something that you could put into a refrigerator because he told us a story that he didn't have anything, you know, only a, a table and a piece of catre or whatever. So, and he told me, you know, Iris, he said, uh, the weather in the past was better, obviously. And he said that he used to make holes, you know, on the ground and put some uh, banana leaves into the hole and put the food there and cover it. And that's it. The next day they open it, right? And took everything, for example, cheese, okay, uh, beans, or any other kind of uh, stuff there. So I was like, wow. So when I was a teenager, I didn't pay too much attention. Now I understand, okay, the different uses, right? Today's class is about that, guys. We are going to describe, we are going to learn how to describe devices or things that you use in your work or in your house using infinitives and gerunds, okay? So I'm going to go over, okay, this, and let's start with gerunds, okay? I'm going to do it fast and, and easy because I want you to understand this simple, right? Uh, Exa, can you please read the first part? Well, the three the three aspects that we have here. Yerun. Ayerun is a verb that acts like a noun. To form Ayerun, add ing to to the end of the verb. Mm -hmm. to, describe, to describe the purpose of something, use for plus gerund. Okay, very good. Simple like this, guys. What is a gerund? A gerund is a when you have a verb, but the verb, okay, you have to add ing. This is a gerund. For example, swim, swimming. Okay, then you have drink, drinking, play, playing, keep, keeping. Okay, so this is a gerund. So when you listen to the, 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 the word gerund, please think of ing. Okay. That's it. This is normal. So why do we use the ing here? So my friends, this is something that I have told you since a long time ago. 
but it's something that is important, okay? Not to make the same mistake once again. When you use for, this is a rule, right? This is something that you cannot break and use it, ah, whatever, no. Try to keep this in mind because at the moment you're speaking, you have to use it. When you are using for, the word for, and you want to use a verb immediately, you have to add the ing, okay? For example, when you want to say, remember for, it's like para, para dormir, para comer, para ir, para aprender, para hacer. So in English, guys, you have to say this, for going, for drinking, for doing, for, okay, for learning, okay? So people usually say, for go, for have, for do, for make, and that's the mistake, okay? This is what you don't have to do. You have to keep this in mind, okay? That any time that you're using for, you have to add ing to the following verb, okay? So this is to describe the purpose of something, okay? For example, if I have here, let me show you this, right? So if you are curious, you're going to ask me, ask the question, please. In Spanish, ya me hubieran dicho, ¿qué es eso? In English, how would you say this? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. What is this? What is this? Uh -huh. Well, the question is, the question is, what is this? The answer is, it's a bottle. <laughs> You're asking the question, what is it? All right. Uh -huh. So, o me querrán preguntar, ¿Qué es it's eso? Es una un bote. Pero ¿y para qué es? ¿Para qué es eso, teacher? ¿Eh? Like my daughter, my, my daughter, I have a daughter, you know that. Now is almost four years old and she has everything. Mommy, what is it for? Listen to the question. What is it for? At the end, you have to put for if you want to ask for the purpose, okay? ¿No saben qué es? Pregunten, what is it? ¿Para qué es? What is it? For. So, when you ask what is it for, then I'm going to give you the answer. This is for cleaning jewelry and glasses. Oh, so what is it, teacher? Well, it's a spray. Spray? Oh, and what is it for? Oh, it is for cleaning. Yuri, you know, Yuri, uh, bracelets, necklaces, earrings, okay? Uh, and uh, glasses as well. Oh, okay. Good. Well, you see, I am giving. Okay, describing the purpose of something. What is this something? The bottle, okay? So keep this in mind, please. Keep this in mind. I am repeating this because I want you to do it this way. Four plus Jaron. Four plus Jaron, okay? Let's check here. Let's go over some examples, okay? Karen, can you please read examples? Hi, Karen. My Hello. English class mm -hmm. are yes. uh, for practicing English, not our Spanish. Ah, okay. A this is a purpose of the English class. Second one, please. Yes. A computer is used for making our task easier. Okay, very easier. good. Easier. Uh -huh. Excellent. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. our, my English classes are for practicing. Be careful, please don't say for practice. Hay otros que son golosos, yo le digo alumnos golosos. Eh, no porque coman mucho, sino que hacen esto, mire. Hacen esto, ¿no? For to practice. 
you know, ok, por eso le llamo alumnos golosos, porque ocupan los dos, no me caman, le digo, you only one, ok, you only one, only one, ok, o usa for o use two, but no for two, ok, this is a, a mistake, a big mistake, ok, so if you have it, please don't mention it here in the class, for plus the verb in ing, ok, teacher y se traduce como mis clases de inglés son para practicando, no, this is only the grammar structure. But the moment you are translating this into Spanish, you have to use your logic, okay? So it says, las clases de inglés son para practicar. This is only the structure, guys. But at the moment you are translating it, you have to do it the normal way, okay? The second one, Karen read, it was, a computer is just, right, look, si quiere usar es usada, son usados, please, you have to use is or are, depending, used, right? In past participle with ed, okay? Son es usado, right? For, and the verb in ing, making our tasks, okay? Our duties, our responsibilities, okay? Easier, that's it. So, once again, after four, you have to use the verb in ing. Please don't forget this. Questions right now? No, no questions? Comments? Okay, let's continue with the other one, okay? Because now then we're gonna start practicing. Okay, let's go over infinitives. Carlita Aguilar, hello, good morning, Carlita Beatriz. Morning, teacher. Okay, can you please read, Carlita? Uh, infinitives. Infinitives. Uh -huh. This is an like the, 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 the brother for the gerund. Mm -hmm. An infinitive is the two plus verb form. Very good. Continue. And to describe purposes and use an infinitive. Okay. Very good. So you see here, an infinitive is the two plus verb form. So you can use, if you want to describe the purpose of an object, you can use two alternatives. One with four and the second one with two. What's the difference? The difference between four and two is that with four, you use the verb in ing. And two, the verb is in the original form, the base form, okay? That's the big difference. Look. Examples, okay? Uh, let's see the example. Gabby, can you please uh, uh, go over the, the examples? Okay. Um, why did you Why did you go to the store? Mm -hmm. I went to the store to buy some milk. Ah, okay. Next. Why are you going to USA? Mm -hmm. I am going to USA to learn English. Okay, very good. Look, this is the purpose to go to the store, the purpose to go to the United States, right? To buy some milk, to learn English, okay? So, teacher, what is the difference between four and two in meaning? There is no difference. Both are the same, okay? Let's change, for example, the, the sentences, okay? Uh, Francisco, are you there, Francisco? Good morning. Good morning, teacher. Good morning. Okay, Francisco. I'm going to ask you the question, Francisco, and I want you to answer the questions using first gerund and then infinitive, okay? Let's okay. see. It's the same to buy, okay, the same. Why did you go to the store, Francisco? I went to the store to buy some milk. Okay, now use in a gerund, please. Oh, okay. Why did you go to the store? I uh, went to the store buy some milk. Can you repeat, please? I went to the store buying some milk. Okay, when I said that you have to use the gerund, okay, it's not just ing. Con gerund, okay. ¿qué palabrita van a usar? Les dije. For. 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 Okay, For. don't forget that, Frank. Okay, why did you go to the store, Francisco? 
I went to the store for buying some milk. Excellent. You see? Okay. It's the same, but in different structure. One okay. is with to for... buy, and the second one is for buying. Francisco, okay. the second one. Why are you going to the United States, Francisco? I don't to I going to you. I go to USA uh, for learning English. Excellent, okay, for learning English or to learn English, okay? okay. That's it. So you see, I can is... use mm -hmm. it to form. You can use two forms, right? Ah, the okay. two structures right. are okay. What you cannot do, remember, y esto nunca lo voy a hacer y si lo hace me va a sangrar los oídos, okay. es en la forma golosa, le digo. For to go. Ah, okay. For to do, I know this is horrible. No, 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 no. Okay. okay. My students don't have to say this. Okay. That's it. Ahora bien, ¿qué pasa, teacher, si yo digo for go? Okay. For example, this one, right? Okay. And say for go. Okay. O si digo to going. <laughs> Mezclaron todo, right? Me van a entender, teacher. Well, the customer is going to understand, right? Well, then it's going to be like, ah, quiso decir esto. The customer is going to understand you. Pero en la mente del customer va a ser como un... Ajá, that's it. Siempre les he dicho este, 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 este ejemplo, right? Hay veces hay personas, de, sí, en veces fíjese que yo tengo problemas y ahí nomás, sí, pero ya le dije que de entre todo. ¿Le entienden? Of course you understand, claro que les entienden, pero en su mente está en que, right? So, si quiere que el gringo diga eso, so like, for tú, ok, for to do, for to go, va. Ya les dije, for Yeron, to infinity, ¿ok? ¿Para qué vamos a ese For describing the purpose of one object, ¿ok? For describing the purpose of one object, that's it, ¿ok? So, I hope everybody is looking at me right now, ¿ok? And I'm going to present, ¿ok? Some, some things that I have here with me. I'm going to show you three, three things, okay? Three little things because then you're going to practice, okay? Uh, so I'm going to ask you, look, what is this, guys? To take a look at me, my, my, my screen, okay? So what is this? Can you see? What is this? Maybe on a speaker. Oh, it's on a speaker. Very good. Uh -huh. Mini speaker. Uh -huh. Good. Ahora pregúntenme, ¿para qué es? What is uh -huh. for? What is it? What is, what is this? Póngale el lead porque es este, right? Si okay. no, pues diga, what is the speaker for? Uh -huh. Okay, so what is, the, what is it for? Um, I don't know, guys. What is it for? Juan Carlos, what is this speaker for? Como los pica piedra. You don't know what is it for. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, what is it for, uh -huh, Juan Carlos? Well, Frank Carlos is not here. This is the problem when you don't have a camera because I don't, I can't control if you are there. O solo se conectaron y se fueron, right? Okay, uh, let me check somebody else. Okay, Araceli, okay. What is it for, Araceli? What is the speaker for? Um, for listening, mm -hmm. um, music maybe. Oh, okay, okay, very good. Okay, very good for listening uh, to music. Uh -huh. okay, okay, for listening to music. Okay, good. Exa, any idea? What is the speaker for? Microphone. Uh -huh. okay. No. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yes, go ahead, Exa. What is the speaker for? 
Uh, the speaker is for listening any kind of sound. Okay, okay, for listening to any kind of sound, okay? Like Araceli music for you sounds, yes, because it could be, I don't know, a conference or I don't know, something from the computer, etc. okay? So, ahora ocupemos el tú, okay? I want you to use tú, okay? Veronica, how would you use tú in this case? What is the speaker for? Vero, hello. Hello, teacher. Sorry, okay, Verito. Mm -hmm. What is the speaker for, Vero? Some of you use uh, four. Now I want you to use two, please. For use the germ. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, Araceli and Exa told me, what is the speaker two? Uh, four, sorry, what is the speaker for? He said, uh, Araceli and Exa said, the speaker is for uh, listening to uh, music. Okay, in this case. Now I want you to tell me the same information, but using infinitives, Vero, please. Okay, listening. I don't know, teacher. Sorry. Uh -huh. okay. I confuse. Okay. Itzel. Hello, Itzel. Good morning. Good morning, teacher. Okay, Itzel. Okay. Can you please change the sentence that I already said? Okay. To you, uh, in this case, to use infinitives. For example, the question is what is the speaker for? The answer that Araceli and Exa gave me was. The speaker is for listening to sounds. Now I want you to tell me the same sentence, but using infinitives. Mm -hmm. um, maybe the speaker to use. Mm, no, sorry. No. Uh -huh. the, speaker... Um, maybe the speaker is to listen. Excellent. To music. To music. Very good. Okay, Berito, listen. The speaker is to listen to music, to listen to sounds, etc., etc. Okay? Cuando les digo, remember, when I said gerund, the verb in ing, pero tiene que usar el for. Okay? When I say infinitives, you have to use to plus the base form. Okay? That's it. I'm going to present this, okay, uh, to you. Okay, this one. And I have, okay, this one. Okay, this is an example, a hair dryer. What is a hair dryer for? What is the hair dryer for? Esto es lo que, lo que estamos haciendo, pero con un speaker, okay? A hair dryer is for drying hair. Second. The same is similar, but with other structure. I use a hair dryer to dry my hair. Oh, a hair dryer is to dry hair. Okay, so you are using, okay, a, well, different structures, right? Four and two, okay like the same okay both are the same remember i told you the meaning is the same okay so let's go over other example a radio okay look at the radio very old <laughs> what is a radio for what's a radio for so it's for listening to music or the news another way it's to listen to music or the news. You see, in the first structure, I am using gerunds. In the second structure, I am using um, a infinitives, right? That's it. Now, it's time for you to practice, okay? Now you're going to discuss with a partner. If you want, you can take a picture, please, for this. Make a screenshot. Okay, or only copy the name of the gadget that I'm presenting. Okay, number one, headset. Okay, in this case, the headsets, right? 
Okay, number one, this is the picture number one. Okay, second one, fax machine. Fax machine, this is the second picture. Okay, fax machine, number three, welcome. Welcome, okay. Teacher, return the... the... Sure, sure, uh-huh. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. A fax machine, okay. Okay. Okay, thank you. A Thanks. webcam, okay, a webcam, the number three, a webcam. The number four, a router, okay, a router. It's like, eh, se parece como el casco de allá de, de depredador, teacher. <laughs> okay. Router, okay. A projector, okay. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's a projector projector what is it for okay that's it a usb stick a usb stick okay usb stick a mouse a mouse the device okay no the animal <laughs> teacher okay. return please yes of course a usb stick mm -hmm. That's it. A mouse. Okay. A microphone. A microphone. That's it. Okay. Those are the ones that I have for you guys. Okay. Just one simple sentence. Okay. So you have to ask the question, what is it for okay what is it for if you cannot make all of them but at least please work at least four pictures right or three pictures we have to make okay let's start working right now with your partners and accept the invitation please okay let's start working um you're gonna work in trios now Hi, Gaby. ¿Qué tal, Karen? ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo estás? In English. I'm In sorry. family. Hello, hello. Teacher. Yes, Gavita. This uh, is my sister. Can you show me the webcam, please? Oh, sure, of course. Okay, this is the microphone. Let's no. go over this one. Yes, uh -huh. this. A webcam. Mm Okay, that's thank it. you, teacher. Okay, that's it. This is the question you have to use. What is it for? Okay, this is the question. What is it for? Only in headsets, you have to use the plural because headsets are two. What are they for? Okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. They are for, they are used for, it is used for, and then, or two, right? You have to use... If you want gerund or infinity, right? Okay. Okay, go ahead, please. Más o menos. Why? Okay, girls, now we're going to start working. Yes. Okay. I think you're number one. Uh -huh. Headsets. Headsets. Mm -hmm. I am going to. Ah, uh, only, only. Um, we are doing the. The answer. Yes, you are, uh -huh, the purpose, the purpose of the the object. Mm -hmm. Okay. What is it? Mm -hmm. What is it for? What is it for? Uh -huh. That's it. En el caso de los headsets, como si se fijan, son dos, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. So va a decir, what are 
they for? What are they for? Mm -hmm. What are they for? They are for or they are to? You decide. Usted decide si quiere gerund or infinity. Okay? Let's go over, please. Hello, teacher. Teacher. Hello, Carlita. Hello. Okay. Let's let check. Okay. Headsets. Let's start with the number one. Uh huh. Headsets. Okay. Mm -hmm. Headset. Okay. Mm -hmm. Dele para arriba, Carlita. <laughs> okay. Uh, the headset is for. It is like a. a all right, it's for uh, listen to music or eh, news. Eh, eh. Or... Pay attention, pay attention. Dijo for y dijo listen. It's for listening. It's ah, for listening okay. pay attention. to music <laughs> or a uh, conference. Or... Okay. Anyway. Uh, okay. And um, it is to listen to music or a uh, conference, etc. Okay, very good. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next, a fax eh. machine. A fax machine. Uh, ask, the is... question. ask the question, Francisco. What okay. is it for? Uh -huh. what, what is, is... What is a uh, um, fax, fax machine for? Excellent. Mm -hmm. um, a fax machine, it's, it's for um, this is a multifunctional machine. max machine. Okay, uh, the principal, the principal. Uh, okay, it's for sending uh, documents. Mm -hmm. okay. And it's to send documents. Excellent. For okay. something. Okay, very okay. good. To another uh, fax machine. <laughs> okay. okay, very good. Next, ask a question, Carlita, and Frank, you answer. Uh, what is a uh, welcome for? Mm -hmm. Is to watch uh, other person or a conference is, yes, is uh -huh. to, is to watching. Uh, no, no, no. Is to no. watch. Mm -hmm. or is to watch, watch okay. is is uh, is to watch for uh, other person uh, with uh, in the mirror meeting uh, a conference um, and the, the other is mm -hmm. the other is is uh, for watching mm -hmm. the conference or person uh, and okay. other other things through a computer right mm -hmm. yes yes okay very good. Okay, hey, Carlita, pay attention to Frank if he said to watch or for watch, okay? Yes, <laughs> I, I know, but I, I think that he's nervous right now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes. It's because the teacher is, is, is with, with us. Ah, I am not nervous. <laughs> yeah. The teacher is here. <laughs> he's my friend. I'm nervous. Oh, nervous. really? Okay, good. I'm so happy that you get along well. Okay, I'm going to keep on uh, listening to other people, okay? Okay. Okay, okay. okay. Thanks, Go teacher. Ahead. Go ahead. No, it's to see a person. Yes. See a person in another place. Yes. Ah, the webcam is for showing my dance skills. So, ah, so you use the webcam for, yes. <laughs> for dancing. <laughs> okay. TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Very good. Mm -hmm. Hey, Blanca. A webcam is to take photo. Mm -hmm. Yes. Photo. Okay. Ni tengo. <laughs> Pero <bueno. laughs> Is the day for us. Okay, very good. Ahí, eh, para que sea más completo, póngale a webcam is for, it's okay. El, uh, webcam is just, pueden ahí con el tú, es para que suene un poco más completo. Is just, y di, y di, exa. Ok, just. Ah. Just. Usado. Usada. Is just to see a person. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay, um, another place. Gonna... Eh, 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 in, this, in, this, in the sentence, ahí le ha puesto please, creo. Tiene que ser in another place. P-L-A-C-E. In the, in the webcam. In the webcam sentences. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. 
Another yes. place, another place. Uh -huh. Twice. Okay, very good. Okay. Now, can you go over? I want to check um the <laughs> will the right hand put the note. Uh huh. Uh, let me check. A uh, go over. A uh, scroll up, please. Scroll up. Headsets. Okay. Okay. The headset is used to listen to music. Remember, always when you say listen, you have to use listen to. Yes. Algo que no se lo te venga y te quitar nunca. Listen to, listen to, listen to music, listen to me, listen to the conference, listen to the class, etc. Okay? Very nice. Continue, please. Nice exercise. Okay? ¿Cómo es Telefax? Hello, hello, hello. Let's check. Fax machine. A I use a hat machine, fax machine. To send information. Information, very good. Uh -huh. It's very antiguo. It's older. It's, it's old-fashioned. Old. <laughs> uh -huh. uh, in this case, the fax machine, please. The fax machine. I used. Okay. Uh, um. Después, cuando pongan I use, pongan el aparato. Okay. I use. Pueden poner the uh, fax, fax machine, machine or I use it if you want to. Okay, no problem. I use a fax machine to send information. Aha, very good. Eh, y quítele la E de eh, yo va a used. Mm, eh, Aha, no, no, es, está proyectando. Ah, yes. ah, Jesse, I'm sorry, Jesse. Aha, eh, yo. Okay, I use my headset to listen to music. Aha, very good. Now a webcam. What do you think is a webcam is for? Um, is for project for projecting image for projecting an image. Uh -huh, very good. Projecting, perdón, no an, an image. An image. An, an, a, an I, with a n. a n. Uh huh. No d. Uh -huh. An image. No escuché que se me no escuchó bien. Image. It's for project or oh, projecting uh, an image. Person. An uh, an uh, only a an image. Image. Ah, uh, image. Mhm. Uh -huh. sí. Image. Sin la n. Ajá. Okay. Okay, a webcam. Aha, uh -huh, very good. Go over the next. What is the next uh, device? A router. A router. Okay. What is a router for? Okay, very good. Continue, please. Webcam. Con B. Webcam. Perdón. And watching, le falta la T, watching, después de la Ajá. Yes. Thank you. The next. Okay. The router. What is what is this for? Araceli? <coughs> I don't know how Morita. Uh -huh. Video. Mm -hmm. Images. Así va. I use a project to to I use a projector to project some Pro images. Project. <laughs> Imagen. Sí. Uh -huh. Imagen. 
Images. Sí, images. 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 Ajá, o sea, lo escribís. No, se, se escribe así, pero se pronuncia Ajá. images. 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 A USB stick. What is it for? For transfer information. Okay, very good. Yes. Um, I use up. the USB. 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 <laughs> USB. USB. USB stick for trans. Oh, almacenar. Eh, tus... Ah, ah yes. Very good. Guardar, save, save uh -huh. information. Oh, uh -huh. Save okay. some information. Okay. Pero sería, ajá, to save. To save y el otro for saving. Uh -huh. Ahí el verbo adecuado sería store. Okay, to store. To store, to save. Sí, porque puede grabar la información en, en una computadora también. Ajá, to store, save, some information. Very good. And if you want to use Jerome, you say for? For storing. For storing or for? Saving. Saving. Excellent. Saving. Okay. Mouse. I use a mouse to select. Como seleccionar. O dar click. To click. To click y, and, y el otro for clicking. <laughs> to manage. Para controlar. Ah, ok. ¿Para qué? Uh -huh. To manage. Controlar, manage. Ah. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Manage, controlar, manage, 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 I'm not very good in the in the in the, con, in the controlling the 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 the, the, the keyboard. Uh -huh. So I prefer the mouse. Uh -huh. I use a mouse to manage the computer easier. Mm -hmm. sure. Yes. Yeah. In the microphone. Franklin. Uh, what that is? Hello, um, good morning. Hello, good morning, Tisha. Yeah, hello, how are you? Okay, headsets for listening to music is to listen to music. For sending and scan pages is to send and scan pages. Oh. Very good. For making video calls and to make video calls. Very good. For connecting to internet. Okay, and it's to connect. Connect, in this case, connect by as a connect. Uh -huh. Y me le quita el ED, please. Que sea en ¿Verdad? present. Uh -huh. In present, ok. Eh, projecting, ok, very good. Ok. Eh, eh, presentations, ajá, uh -huh. to project presentation. For saving information, and the other is to save information. A mouse, ajá. Uh -huh. What do you have for mouse? Means for um, move, maybe the cursor, the cursor. Uh -huh. Okay, the cursor mm -hmm. from um, a computer, of a computer. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Uh, the cursor mm -hmm. of, of computer. Mm -hmm. That's it. Very good. Ok, solo me, me, me arregla el projecting, por favor, ahí, projecting va con J, ok. Uh -huh. okay. Ah, sí, si pro projecting, ok. Is to move, exactly, ok, very good, almost done, excellent. Ay, ah. rico. Finish, sí, my friends. Sí.
Hello, teacher. Hey, hey, finish. It's finish. for saving information or pictures. It's to save information, pictures, etc. Okay. We made we made all exercises. Teacher, Excellent. we uh, uh -huh. yes, we made we all. Make, we make all uh, as exercises. Okay. Let, let me check the router because I I finish with you with this. Uh -huh. okay. 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 It is for expanding external signals. It's to expand in internet. It is internet signal. Internet. internet signal. Oh, sorry. Uh -huh. Okay. Go scroll down, please. Scroll down, Carlita. Okay. What happened, Carlita? I don't know. Was, uh, uh... De, de compartir, no sé por qué. Well, you're gonna share, okay. We're Me equivoqué. Proyector is for showing any presentation, is to show any presentations. Ajá, continue, please scroll down. A USB, okay, to save for saving information or pictures, great. Continue, please. Teacher, uh, a mouse, I no lo copié, no lo, no lo mostré. Ajá. Ajá. Ah, okay, 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 a mouse. Pero si la... Uh, okay. por arriba, ya están las demás. Sí, ya todas okay, están. very good. Almost done. Yes, don't worry. Okay, but at okay. least you have some. A microphone. Okay. Ah, I... <laughs> well, thank you. Ah, very microphone. Good. Very good. Okay. The idea is to use four and two, huh? That's it. Yes. Okay. Great. Excellent. Okay, my friends, now we're going to share the answers, please. Okay, um, it is not necessary to tell me both sentences, one with two and one with infinite and with gerund, no, only one, okay? But you decide whatever you want, okay? We're going to start with the first one, okay? Uh, well, the, the, the headsets, we already know that, that's for listening to music or any other sound you want to transmit, right? Uh, we're going to start with this one, okay? The fax machine, Gabby, please tell me the fax machine, please. Fax machine. What is it okay. for? Mm -hmm. I use the fax machine for sending information. For sending information, excellent, very good, okay? A, a Blanquita, please, Blanquita, a webcam. What is it for? Mm, a webcam is used to make photo okay to make photos very good okay uh, any other idea Vero, for a webcam uh, a webcam is used to see other person in to see uh, to person in other place Okay, very good. Through a computer, right? Excellent. A router, Giovanni, what is a router for? Uh, maybe it's for repeat, repeating mm -hmm. signal Wi-Fi. Oh, very good. It's for repeating. Very good. Okay. Sometimes it is like a repetition, right? Repeating. Uh -huh. Very good. Carlita Aguilar, what's a projector for? Carlita, good morning. Hello. Okay, Frank. What is a Sorry, project? Sorry, teacher. Ah, okay, um, Carlita, you are there. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. This is a project uh, Carlita. Um, for us, uh, a projector is for showing any presentations. Oh, very good for showing some presentations, any kind of presentation, something you want to present. Itzel, what's a USB stick for? What's a USB stick for? The USB stick um, to um, guardar. Safe. 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 Yes, gracias. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> save. <laughs> save. Save the yes, information. Save. <laughs> or image or Movies, any. Music, right? Okay. Documents. <laughs> That's it. Right? Nice. <laughs> A mouse, uh, let me check here, okay. Um, let me see here, Karen, what's a mouse for? Uh, I use mouse for 
to select or or manage uh, the computer more is e easier easier okay to select or to manage okay very 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 good okay and the microphone somebody has the microphone uh-huh somebody any idea uh is for is for to speak uh okay. many persons okay. it's <laughs> it's to it's speak for... it's to speak it's... Ah, okay. Uh, many so persons. Speak, uh -huh, to other people. Loud, okay. Uh -huh. Yes. Loud. Pero ahora hágamelo con, con gerundio, por favor, Frank. Ah, uh -huh, Francisco. Is, is for speaking. Yes. Okay, very good. Uh -huh. okay. It's for speaking. Uh, louder. Many persons, louder. <laughs> okay, very <laughs> good. When I say louder, you know, it's como más, más, más fuerte. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay, very, very good. Keep this in mind, guys, okay? Keep this in mind. For ING. Yo sé que es algo que ya traen metido aquí que for go, for do, for speak, for etc. Pero deben adelante, all right? Try to. Deben adelante si Liana escucha que Juan Carlos dice eso, all right? Well, correct, Juan Carlos, right? Si Frank escucha que Giovanni dice eh, to doing o... Oh, Como siempre. Ok, correct, ok. <risa> si Jesse escucha que Carlita Aguilar dice, este, bájate para abajo, corre. <risa> okay. Correct, ok. This is the idea, guys, ok. Somos un grupo, ok. So, estamos aquí para aprender. We are a group and we are here for learning, ok. And for correcting, ok. Any mistake you listen to someone, don't be like, Oh, no se van a enojarse un día, le dicen, mira, dijiste mal, ay, ¿y vos qué te crees? No, 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 no. Everybody's learning, so it's a very good idea when somebody points out the mistakes, so you have to be thankful and say, thank you, okay, thank you, I'm not going to make that mistake anymore, okay? My friends, the attendance, and we finished, okay? Yesenia Ivet Abarca Vázquez. Present. Carlita uh, Beatriz Aguilar. Present. Verónica Beatriz Celso. Present. Osmani Etzaú de León. Present. Vania Itzel Deras de Cañas. I'm here. Blanca Estela Marroquín. Present. Franklin de Jesús Martínez. Uh, here. Carla Joana eh, Martínez. Eh, well, Carlita is here, but she has problems Present. in her microphone, okay. Giovanni Alberto Orantes. Present. Gabriela Beatriz Reyes. Present. Dalila Estela Silva. Present. María Araceli González. Present. Cindy Elizabeth Mejía. Present. Sofía Guadalupe Hernández. So, eh, absent. Ok, Juan Carlos Molina. Juan Carlos, Juan Carlos. Ok, present. Yo creo que tiene problema Juan Carlos. De, 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 escribiendo de, de, ahí. Yes, ajá, ahí está escribiendo. Y yo diciendo que andaba viendo el noticiero. <risa> Claudia Ileana Cazún. <risa> present. <risa> Ileana Cazún, present. Brenda Lucía Rosales, absent. Herbert Iván Martínez, absent. Karen Lizeth Reyes. Present. Karen, okay. Present. Carmen Elena Cornejo. Present, teacher. Okay. And Francisco Isaac Cabrera. Okay. Present. That's it. My friends, thank you very much for joining the conference for today. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay. Remember, you have to start doing the section number two. Okay. okay. Thank you, guys. Have a beautiful see morning, you. everybody. Thanks, Thanks teacher. Bye. Thank you. Bye, everybody. Bye.